Back row ministry world premiere, Mr. Markley coming at you live and direct from the basement here. So real quick, I just want to talk about the deaths of um, Tiny Lester, um, dead at 62, and actress um, Natalie DeSalle. And Natalie DeSalle, if you might remember Natalie by face. picture of Natalie. Natalie DeSales was in um, two shows. She was in Eve and then she was in a movie called Baps with Halle Berry a long time ago. So she died first and then um, following um, her death we had the death of Tiny Lister. So quickly we'll just pull up some dates some things I want you guys to kind of see when we decode the death. Now Tiny's death was Really, really simple. So, Tiny Lester dead at age 62. So, the date of his death, I'm going to do this as we talk. I want the people to see how we do this. You're going to go to tools. You're going to go to date. <clears throat> and they had it listed where he died. All right, so I thought the 10th is when the story came out. So December 10th was a day with 62 numerology. That's the first thing I saw when I had saw this story on that Friday. It came out on Thursday. I saw it on Friday because at that time I was also decoding a football game. And that was the Patriots versus um, who the Patriots play. I forgot who the Patriots play, but I know they lost. So the Patriots, in the Patriots game, the Patriots got the loss. Oh, the Patriots played the Rams, and the Rams beat the Patriots. But in that game, the significant thing was Cam Newton got his 62nd all-time loss. And if you go to what we do when we do our sports, you go, we go to pro football statistics and reference. You put in your quarterback, be it Cam Newton. Hit the cam button. Game logs. And if you go down all time, see how Cam? 137 games he's played. He got that 60 second loss and that came on Thursday. 62 was the number for that day. So anytime you do a sport decode, you go to the, the, the numerology for that day. You see a lot of times numerology will play. So 62 played that day. And surprising that right after that, you have a uh, tiny list of passing at 62. So let's look at tiny. So we know already that this is murder by numbers because, you know, if you look at Tiny, Tiny Lister, who played Debo on Friday, dies at 62. Um, you know, Tiny used to be a wrestler. Um, Tiny was in the movie No Holds Barred with Huck Hogan. That's Huck Hogan's first starring role where Tiny plays Zeus. So I'll take all those things into account when you do your decode. So I do a gang of numbers up here with Tiny. You you can th throw Zeus up there and see if you find a relation. So remember, Zeus is 26, 71, 17, 26. You see that inside of the numerology. And I'll remove a couple of ciphers because the mathematical cipher is one. I don't use a lot. So I don't want you to get bogged down with ciphers. But we got 19 numerology, 17, 26. So just look what was going on that day. Zeus is 26. You know, uh, that's a day with 26 numerology. You got 12 plus 10 plus 2 plus 0 plus 2 plus 0 equals 26. So that's another key thing inside of that. So could this be a death for the WWE? Remember now, rolling into the new year, McMahon, anyone who's a, he's ever signed to a contract, is always these myster mysterious WWE deaths around this time too. So take Zeus into account. Ah, Debo. Let's retype it. I want everybody to be able to see it. So in the movie Friday, 
He plays the popular character Debo. Debo is the popular character. So Debo is 31, which is 11. Remember, 31 is 11 prime. 22 is 11, 11. Uh, 23, 104, you know, 279. 59 is the Negro number. 59 is the Negro number. So, you know, Debo is the Negro. And he's that dude in on Friday. And I think that they're reporting, if I'm not mistaken, it was a day with 63 numerology, the day they reported this. Go back and check. One thing. No, no. So we'll stick to what we're doing, but just always double check those numbers because it got reported on the 11th. So remember 31, the 11th prime, they reported that, that he had died on 11th, going into that 11th. And then um, that was also, they were 22 numerology. Devo, lower, lesser numerology, but still significant. Devo equaling 22. And that's Friday. Remember Ice Cube was in the news a lot during this um, election. So he got him some uh, attention during this election. He was self-sacrifice. Ice Cube's been a part of a lot of self-sacrifice. Ice Cube, 42, the king of the Negro Code. And we'll also take the movie Friday. Friday, 36. Number 36 is just 6, 63. The next day it was reported. 63-day numerology. And this is kind of be how you do your your breakdown to, to get as much as you can. His name is Tiny, really Tommy, but Tiny. Tiny is 22. Remember Debo. Debo is also 22. Tiny is 22. 22 11 ritual. That's what we saw. And then you could do birth date. So let's get Tiny's birth date. Tiny's birth date. So Tiny, now this switched up because Dr. Tiny is actually born in Compton. They say he's born in the South, but they're saying he's born in Compton. I remember Tiny being born in the South. So Pine Bluff, Arkansas would be his birthplace because he has a lot of family in Louisiana. But... They're saying Tiny was born June 24th, 1958. Died December 10th. So you can always do your count. So from June 24th to 6, 24, 20. To death date is 169 days. 24 weeks, one day. Five months, 16 days, but our big number is 169 days. So let's see what 169 gives us. Is 169 have any greater properties? Is it a Fibonacci number? Is it a triangular number? Is it a prime number? So 169. I like that thing. It's going to play around with you too. Find that this app isn't working the greatest. <coughs> Not gonna let us do it, we just open up another box. Shut my mics up. Nice playing around with us. No fret. Got another box up here we go to. Now, sometimes with this software, it's old, so it'll mess up a point. You have to play with it a couple of times. All right, so 169 is the square root of 13. So 13 times 13 is 169. So we got the square root of 13 inside of that. Didn't have any 13 date numerology that I saw. So let's go. We looked at a couple of things. And we'll put his full name and let's do a search of full name. We did Tiny. Let's do Tiny Lister. Tiny, 61, 65. See how they teetered towards 62 but didn't get there? 151, 83. <clears throat> so 
61 is 18. Tommy, Tommy Lister. See how Tommy is 22. See how all his names kind of equal out to the same. So if you think people like Ice Cube is not a part of all this, don't be mistaken. Cube, he had to do something to get where he was going to get. So don't think he won't, won't do a sacrifice. I mean, they all do the same thing. All right. He was also in the movie The Fifth Element, and that kind of struck out to me because he played the president in The Fifth Element, for those that remember The Fifth Element movie. So we got 75, 80, you know, 249, 69, 87. So not much to go off for The Fifth Element, but I definitely wanted to pull it up. Um, 156, let's see, is... Okay, so not much in the fifth element, but always good to kind of pull it up and take a look at it. Take a look at everything that goes on in movies. And <clears throat> one thing I do want to pull up is his name in the fifth element. It's been kind of hard to find. He's in a lot of different things, a lot of different things. But he says is that he, he's from, he's born and raised in Compton. He stayed in Compton pretty much his entire life. But born in the South, moved to moved to Compton. That's what I remember the story. So, and a lot of things that you'll find. Some things that you'll see in some of the stories. So they said he was six foot five in one story. So always look at your numbers. And you look at six foot five. Tony, tiny. Uh, when we put Tiny Lister in. Tiny Lister is 65. So always look at Pacifics that they put in the story. They're always going to try to knock these Pacifics. It'd be, it, why should that matter? He was six foot five. But they're going into the ritual and telling you how his name summed up in Gematria to, to, to the death. They want to tell you everything about it. It's kind of like they brag to say that they killed the person. It's kind of really, really sick. But these are the type of individuals that we're dealing with. So. Tiny Lester passed away. And then they call him Tiny Debo Lester. I don't think Tiny wasn't a part of the society because he's in the society too, like I say. You sign on with these guys, think it is all to the good, and then you find out later it's all to the bad. Tiny Debo Lester, 88. Trump, 88. <clears throat> but the big thing, like we said, with Debo's death was he died at 62 on a date with 62 numerology. Then they're saying he died from COVID symptoms. So they said early in the year he experienced COVID. They're not, they're not saying he died from COVID, but like we said, everything was going to be about COVID deaths. Of course, COVID symptoms, 68, 76, 77. Seventy six, ninety four, sixteen. 94, 16, just go, just go to your, what you got. See if you see a vibration of them trying to purposely create a vibration. You got a lot of 83 with Debo. <clears throat> so COVID by itself. 
So COVID is 26. So Mimi died on a date with 26. Numerology, COVID is 26. COVID is 28. COVID is 53. COVID is 79. Remember, 53 is 16. And that might play a part in the, well, it doesn't play a part in the other death, but also you'll see that that person died at 53 years old. COVID is 53. So, you know, look at, you know, look for all those things, your 53s, everything to find your vibration to see, you know, to kind of put the sacrifice together. But we know everything is COVID now. So anybody who dies, they, uh, they got to be, they got to die to COVID. Got to die to COVID. But 3122, you see how his name vibrates with 3122. We got the 76s. stuff so, so go over everything make sure you're going over everything looking at everything to the t when you do this and you know as you put the ritual and who you might have been sacrificed for together too so make sure you put all that together you got your cube all these are big players in the death of tony um then he died on thursday so remember one thing about thursday so this is the significance, and we might not have number significance, but Thursday is a day of a day of death and killing. Remember, COVID is forty four. I'm gonna save Thursday because I want you guys to see. So Thursday is forty four one sixteen fifty five. COVID. Is 44. So that's where that relationship with him dying on Thursday comes because COVID is the kill code. Thursday also holds the kill code. And what's significant about Thursday? Because Thursday, if you look at the origin of Thursday, And we talking about the origin of days, and I always look up the origin of days because days are very powerful things. But Thursday is the day of the week between Wednesday and Friday, we know. The name is Thor's Day, and we know that Thor is the son of Zeus. Thor is the son of Zeus. Thus, the ritual of Thursday and him dying on Thursday, him also being named Zeus, because that is the day of his son, Zeus's son, which is Thursday. So see other parts of the ritual add up. Oh, let's kill Zeus on Thursday, the death of the father on Thor's day. And you could also put in Thor's day. See if you get more significance, you get 52, 47, 38, 43. but a lot inside of him dying on that Thursday. And the 62, like I said, was the big piece. And then, you know, I'm just really thinking about, remember Zeus, 26? Him dying on that Thursday, the day of, you know, the day of, you know, Thor's day. Zeus, 37. Number 37 is the 12th prime number, so that's where our 12 relation comes in. And just scanning over everything we got. We got 37, 1, 2, 3, 3 down. Thursday is 37. So him dying on Thursday, him being named Zeus, all a part of this 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 ritual for the death of Tiny Liston. So big, big ritual taking out Tiny. So the next actress, but she actually died before him, was Natalie DeSalle. Natalie DeSalle. And like I say, if you, you know, aren't really familiar with a lot of, um, Black movies, African American movies, you know, you don't know a lot of the actresses, you know, um, that have been in the movies. I've known this actress since she was younger, since she was a girl. So I've pretty much followed her career for a long period of time. But you no, know, yeah, she passed passed away. Let's see if we can pull up something else on Natalie.
So Natalie passed away. And Natalie was age um, 53. She was age 53. She died on Monday. And you see she died of colon cancer, just like uh, uh, Chadwick Boseman did. Died of colon cancer. So don't think just because you see cancer that these things still aren't staged and put together. They're always staged and put together. So what I'm going to do with Natalie, I'm going to do a, 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 cold, a total clear out. All right. So you start from the basics. And we can pull up colon cancer. Colon cancer is 59, 77, 49. We're going to say that first. All right. We want to get our date. So Monday was the 7th when she passed, I believe, December the 7th. All right. So she passed on December 7th, and you can see she died of colon cancer. Colon cancer is 59, December 7th, right at the top, standing there looking at you. It's 59 dating the numerology. Like I say, when you get involved in this, especially the lessers, you'll find that the lessers that don't really produce much are the ones they sacrifice the most. So 59, colon cancer, 59, remember, Negro is 59. Negro 59, 32. Negro also 22. So it's always a deeper ritual, ritual in what they're trying to do. So that's why they picked that day. Monday is also the day of the moon. That's the significance of Monday. It's moon day. So we'll look at numbers related to the moon. 15, 21, 57, 15. And then, of course, spell out the day, Monday, 27. Let's say that, too. So let's put a name in. It's kind of a tough name. First name, Natalie. So Natalie, 46, sacrifices, 46, 62, 26, the God number, 64. Look inside of that day. We got 24, we got 12, numerology, 23 is 9, we'll look at that. Now, next name is kind of, I want to say it's 2, no, I don't think that's it. All right, let me get her name right, it's a difficult name to spell. D-E-S-S-E. All right, let me see. let me save it. Good, good. That'll help us. Very do. It's a like a French name almost, or something she made up. You know, Hollywood star love to make it up. Pace. All right. So Natalie Desele. Okay. So if you take her whole name, Natalie Desele, you'll see in full reduction that Natalie Desele is fifty three. You know, right off the bat, this is a sacrifice. We didn't even have to get that deep in her name. Natalie DeSalle, 53, dead at age 53. She had a video where she was talking about the importance of, you know, looking back, hindsight being 2020, why she never should have signed an acting contract. But dead at 53, you know, perfect sacrifice. And the lessers are the ones they sacrifice the quickest. You'll find at when she do this research. It's easy to kind of put it together. Tiny had a lot of hits and stuff. You really have to... Um, 163, death is 163. And go to some of the stuff we already looked up with Natalie. Let's see if we got any 38. But death is 38. Dead at 53. Natalie, 62. And funny how Natalie is 62. And then... A couple of days down the road, we get a 62 ritual with T. 
Tiny Lister dying at 62. So a lot of times it just piggybacks off the other, you know, the connection. Natalie 62, let's pick a, a individual that's 62 years old now on a date with 62 numerology on Thor's Day. Perfect ritual, sac ritualistic sacrifice of Zeus, the father of Thor on Thor's Day. The father dies on his son's day. You see how it is? The father dies on the son's day. So very sick ritual inside that killing a tiny Lester, but perfectly tied in with the death of Natalie DeSelle, um that Monday, Moon Day riding in the Thor's day. DeSelle, 45, 27, 99. Um, if, you, if you want to, you can look at from the time of her death and birth So Natalie Sella is a Louisiana girl. And then, like I said, the ties between both of these individuals. He's from Pine Bluff, right up the road from Louisiana. She's from Louisiana, too. Both of them are from the same area, born in the same area. Tiny was raised in California. Don't get it twisted. He's a Compton dude all the way. But she was born in Louisiana. So her birth date is July the 12th. And if we take her birth date... So from the time of her birth date to the time of the story was 148 days, 148 days or two, you know, we get um 21 weeks, one day. So we'll look at 148, which probably is not going to give us anything. Those are all even numbers. 14 and 8. So you're not going to get anything, but I'm going to take 211. I took 211 because that gives me 47. That's 47 prime. Remember, 47 is, I want to say, 15 or 16. It's either 15 or 16. Ah, right, here we go. All right, here we go. We're doing good. Let's take 47. Yeah, 47 to 15 prime. So go back to our date numerology. Date 14 numerology, 24, 59, no, no 15 numerology. Go back to our names. Let's see if we get any 15 numerology tying in. And go back to her name as a whole, Natalie. Ninety one thirteen one sixty three fifty three not much, but the big piece is that Natalie is fifty three Natalie dead at fifty three um didn't look at colon cancer again colon cancer fifty nine you know the negro number fifty nine fifty nine date numerology. Gives more power to the ritual. Now, Natalie was in several shows. The uh, most popular one that a lot of you might remember, she was in the show with Eve. Eve is 14. Eve 14, 32. Eve 13. Eve 49. Remember, she died of colon cancer. 49 in, in colon cancer there. There's colon cancer, 49 Eve. So there's a relationship between her and Death and Eve, relationship number one. Then she was in the movie Baps, which is a very dumb movie, and I had the pleasure of never fully watching it or liking any part about Baps. But Baps 25, Baps 38, 34, 11, 25, and you want to tie any tie in. 38, the number of death. And that is significant because, remember, one... Let me 
say. Yeah, so 163, remember, was the 38th prime number. BAPS is 38. And if you go to 163, go to her name, Natalie D. Shelley was 163 in reverse for reduction. So it ties in with the movie BAPS. These are all contracts that she signed. There's two contracts down. She was also in a play called For Your Love, and that's the last thing she was in. And For Your Love is significant because For Your Love is 53. That was the last contract she signed. She died at 53 years old of the colon cancer, and she was in For Your Love. For Your Love is 53. You see how it all tied in together? Every contract she signed, she signed, summed into her name, and also summed into her death. Name and death all kind of tied into various contracts she signed. So, you know, getting involved with these people, you got to understand, they will kill off the lessers before they kill off the big-time stars. Not to say the big-time stars, their deaths are going to come. But they will kill off the, le the lessers before they kill off the big-time stars. And funny how her name kind of attached her to certain projects. But For Your Love, being 53, and Natalie dying at 53 ties everything together. Plus, we got the 59 date numerology on December the 7th, which is colon cancer was 59. See how they tied it in? She's going to die of colon cancer on that specific day. And don't think just because somebody, you know, <coughs> kind of rare two people dying from the same ailment. It's easy for me to say that this person died of this or this person died of that. Anybody can be murdered. That's the problem with the world. We say, well, a person, but well, they've been sick. I can make anybody sick. You can give people cancer. Science has improved over the, the centuries. You can give a person cancer. They have a way of activating certain cells, turning cells on, turning cells off. Look um, some, up some of those TED Talks, cell activations by computer. They can do that. So there's a lot of stuff that goes on that, you know, we're not privy to. And, and murder by numbers have been going on for a long period of time. There's nothing for me to poison you or, or give you something to kill you. I mean, I can inject a virus into you and, and shut down your whole body. You can inject, in, inject bad cells into people and kill them. So it's not like this stuff is mysterious. But in our mind, everything has to be mysterious. And, only, and you can only get sick by some godly intuition. When man created God and sometimes... Um, a man goes rogue. So remember that part. But if you get, you know, kind of caught up in this, and there's another young lady who just wanted to, to live a Hollywood dream, and she's dead at 53. <clears throat> dead at 53. She was also in Medea's Big Happy Family, a Tyler Perry special. And For Your Love might be another Tyler Perry special because he's got a list of people he can sacrifice. I don't think he don't. We'll put big, happy family. I'm going to break down on that. So big, happy family, 158, 78, 84, 93. I'm going to cross the spectrum. Mind me, I can look a certain way in my eyes. So 77, um, nigga roll was 77, but not seeing much across the spectrum when it comes to that. If somebody else can catch it, I'll do it real slow. Maybe you can catch it. You can go back and rewind, and then you can capture. And let me put Medea in here, because the ritual would be Medea. Because that is the primary character. So uh, it doesn't work spell it right that's the thing I don't like about computers they're going to tell you what you want to spell you will notice that so Medea the big happy family 103 103 is 27 103 is 27 the 27th prime number is 103 uh, 113 104 All right. hey just go track track and see what you find 
Colon cancer is 103. Mabdia's big happy family is 103. So don't be surprised. And let's look it up now. It's For Your Love, a Tyler Perry play. Let's look it up. Trying to see. No, that's something else. I don't want to tie it into that. Trying to see what that last. It's not really giving me. All right. Yeah, not really giving me. But look up for your love and see. Yeah, see some what you can find on this for your love. I'm definitely trying to It's a play, but I don't know whose play it is, so definitely look up the for your love piece to see if you can bring any ties. But we see that there's a tie between Medea big Medea's big Medea's big happy family, which is one oh three. And colon cancer, which is 103. So, like, every contract she signed, pretty much kind of, she died for those contracts. We're seeing that. She died for those contracts. So, this is how murder by numbers works. It doesn't matter what they say you died from, as long as you can tie it into the sacrifice. So, the sacrifice can come. Of course, I'm not going to make it look like, you know, uh, obvious that I killed you, but it's various ways that you can murder somebody and get away with it because we got so many health issues out there. It's easy to write off a person's death as a health issue. And some of the deaths are so ridiculous that, you know, they just get away with them. And, you know, that never, they're never challenged anyway. So we had the death of Natalie DeSelle, and then down the road, another Louisiana, Arkansas person died. Two people born in the same area, region of the country, died back to back. And he dies three days after her. There's your, your three ritual, the ritual of threes. So she died, he dies three days after her. And he's 62. Her name, remember, Natalie is 62. An a, a actor was picked after that three days later. That was 62 years old on a date with 62, um, 62 numerology. There's so much to it. But this is how you put it together. This is how you can put it together. You got to look at every part of it to, to kind of see where the vibrations go in the numbers and how their life vibrated with their death at the end. But you sign these contracts, it's what it's all about, murder by numbers. So, Mr. Mockley Back Row Ministry, be safe.